Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Thursday the 4th of July 2024. Uh, Independence Day in the US I suppose but possibly Independence Day in the UK. Uh, let's kick out the Tories. Um, after so many years, more than a decade of misrule and horrific treatment of just about everything in the UK, there is a chance. Now, the problem is that I don't want people to be complacent. You know, sometimes Labour has been polling well ahead in the in the polls um, before, uh, but th those are unimportant. And the problem is that sometimes people think, oh, well, Labour are miles ahead, I won't bother to go and vote. Well, that's not the right attitude, is it? If you have a vote, please go and vote for them. And please mercifully vote to kick out the Tories. That might mean tactical voting in your area. It might mean a vote for the Lib Dems or something. Definitely not for reform, of course, though. That's not the right way forward. Um, please vote to kick out the Tories. And uh, even though Labour, you know, it seems like Tory light at the moment, if they had get a large majority, and if it, remember, you know, in the UK, you're not voting for a president, right? Keir Starmer might be a pretty naff leader, but it's the Labour Party and hopefully the members in your area, in every area, uh, that control the party, really, that force the party forwards. And hopefully something a bit more radical, because something radical needs to be done. The NHS has completely fallen apart. And that's the main focus, really. The main thing is that the NHS has been so underfunded and so badly managed over the last more than decade uh, that it's time for a rethink, restart, major funding. And the tiny amount that Labour have promised needs to be much bigger. And it needs to be done by taxing the super rich and getting rid of tax loopholes and corporate tax loopholes as well so many things are where ta so many things where taxes avoided or evaded both all right so good luck uk um i still care about you a bit i left you a long time ago but you i still think about you right let's get on with the sudoku shall we this is the guardian's hard level puzzle first hard level of the week because it's thursday I'll start with ones in these squares here and by the way, if anybody happens to be in Rhys Mogg's <laughs> constituency, please, please go and vote against him. The people that I would love to see uh, uh, lose their seats are Liz Truss, Rhys Mogg, um, um, Sunak. There's a possibility that Sunak might lose his seat, but I'm, I'm less worried about that. I'm much more... Oh, Johnson. I, I'm not sure if Johnson is running. I think he's not running, is he? I don't know if he's retired or not now, but anyway, Truss and Rhys Mogg. If you could kick out those, please, then I'd be forever grateful. Nines are in these squares. Let's get on. Twos block across here and here. That's going to put two into that square. Seven blocks these squares. Seven blocks this square. Seven blocks this square. So in this column, there's a seven. Seven across here and across there will give us seven in that square. Seven down here, down there, there's another seven. And seven across here, across there, and down there, there's another one. That's as far as we can take it, though. We'll be left with sevens in those particular squares there. Uh... Four blocks this square and four blocks this square. So here's a four in this row. Uh, eight blocks this square. So here's an eight and here's a three to finish this row. What do we look? Oh, no. Eight down here, eight up there, and eight across there. So we get eight there. Uh, five is one of our missing numbers here, so this can't be five. Six blocks this square here, so this has to be five and six, and this must be a four. Four across here, four up here, that puts four into that square there. Now this was five and 
three, three and five, so that's our three down there, and this is going to be a six. What are we left with up here? One, three, six. Not enough info yet. What are we left with? Um, well, hang on a second. Okay, we've got four blocking up here, four up there, so there's a four. Shall we start looking uh, around and seeing if we can spot anything this way? Two blocks these two squares, two blocks this square and this square, so there's two we can grab. Three blocks up there, so here's our three. Five has been there all the time, and you've been shouting at me. Okay, got it now, thank you. Six there. Six down here, six down there, and there's a six. Six down here, there's a six. Six across this way and this way, there's another six. And I can see a pair of six and seven up here, six and seven up there, and six and seven across. So I do know that's six and seven in those squares. I don't know if it means much, but that's six and seven. Uh, we'll just have a quick look at this and otherwise we'll carry on I think uh, 5, 8, 9 I guess ok uh, I was going through I was I hadn't finished doing what I was doing right I got to 6 and I think I got to 6 and 7 Oh, this is two now, two up there, so there's our seven. So then we've got seven blocking like this, and up there, and across there, there's our seven. And the other number, I think, was a four. Was it? No. What was the other number? Six. Six up there, six up there, six across there. There is our six. Six across here, there, and up there, and up there will give us six in that square, one blocks across here, we need a one in this column, it goes there, and I think five was the other, no, eight, no, what is the other number, three is the other number, sorry for that column, part of my apologies, three across there and there, you can see I'm playing the game live, thinking it all out as I go along, which is why I make so many spoken mistakes, but hopefully not too many actual mistakes, eight blocks up here, that puts eight into that square there, and this is a five, five blocks up here and across there gives me five in that square there uh, eight blocking up here and across there there's an eight we can have five 
four blocks this square so in this row there's our four this will be a nine nine blocks across here giving us nine there uh, we're looking here for one and four I think so four up there gives us four in that square one in that square one down to the bottom here gives me a one there uh, not too much more to go now is there really that's pretty fast five blocks down here there's the five this will be a three the last lot to get down here are two three and nine I think and don't know which is which uh, what are we looking at down the bottom here um, nine and three not sure what's what so that's got to be two and five is it so five across there yeah five down there there's our five and we just need a two to complete this column two across here two across there there's our two uh, okay what are we left with uh, three five there we go five across there five down there and the last number here looks to be a nine nine across here gives us nine in that square the missing number here is three over here we are looking for eight I think it is and this is three three across there puts three in that square and a nine finishes the game so not very tough hard level puzzle from the Guardian for Election Day UK. Take care. Bye-bye.